Hey bud, you find any yet? No? Okay. We're looking for chanterelle mushrooms. They're a good edible, they're orange, orange to a light yellow. A really good edible. Uh, they usually come up in this area this time of year. There's some right there. Nice ones. Well, I thought it was nice. Looks like something beat me to it. Hey, bud, get off the mushrooms. Oh, yeah, these are still very choice. See? Those are very, very good. But he's my hunting buddy. Yeah. Yeah, those are nice ones. Keep going through the woods here, see what we can find. Always make sure you don't have gills. If you, if you have gills, versus veins, you don't want them. So let's keep looking. All right, bud. I want to get across the creek and see if I can find any over there. I know they're there, I've seen some. And I thought this was a possible way to go, but the root ball looks like it's gonna block me. So we'll just keep walking until I find another spot. Found a good spot to cross. Sounds like thunderstorms coming too. Come on, bud. Let's hurry up and find those mushrooms before it gets raining too hard. hit the jackpot here. Look at this big bed. Those are definitely chanterelles. They're a good size. Oh yeah. This is a good find. Oh man, yeah. That's what I'm talking about right there. That's what I'm talking about. Good size mushroom, great texture. They're not too wet. Hadn't rained yet today, but it's about to. Perfect example. Very good, clean mushroom. Prime time for the picking. And there are, there are a good many around too. So I'm gonna get started. Just keep coming. Look at that. It's almost as big as the palm of my hand. Oh yeah. I believe we found today's winner. Well, that's, that's a good one right there. 
it's a big one. In my hand. This is as big as my hand. Turn it over. Look at that. That's the, the Grand Pumba of the day right there. And there's so many around here. I should have brought another bag. Um, but I can only eat so much. I'm the only one in my household that eats them. But uh, Bud sure enjoys helping me find them, don't you, Bud? Yeah. Another look alike. That's another look alike. From a distance, you would think it is a shin trail. Turn it over. See the gills. Running one by one from the stem to the rim. There's that white juice coming out. The uh, white latex like juice coming out of it. So. No good for us. But I found us a way across the creek. I don't know if we'll make it, but we're gonna try. Here we go. Come on, bud. Bud's saying, you're crazy. I'll go through the water. Bud said it was too hot and he's getting in the creek. Feel good, bud? You're a good boy. Feel good? Beautiful creek out here. Nice, clean water. Usually I can find a few mushrooms on the on the bank. I'm not seeing any so far. We'll find some more though. I just found a mushroom fungus I've never seen before. First I thought it was a piece of trash, a piece of uh, tape or something growing out of the side of the, the creek bank. But it's not. It's actually a, a bluish looking mushroom. Fungus. It appears to have uh, veins, not gills. So I wonder if there, if there is such a chanterelle. I'm gonna look it up. Can't pass this up. I gotta check it out. I want you to see what happened when I touched the mushroom. Um, it turned blue and blue juice started coming out on my fingers. So watch this. Look at that. Blue. I'm not sure that's such a good thing, but it'll help me find out what it is, identify it. So here's some of the big ones I found today, the big chanterelles. Harrison, there's my hand. You can see those are some good ones. This is the biggest I found today. Be very good in a uh, red wine vinaigrette with butter and sauteed. The one I found on the creek bank was, I believe, I believe it's called a blue milk cap mushroom. Um, I've read and it's supposed to be edible. However, I'm not familiar with it. I think it's really cool the way it bruises, bruises blue, and then it'll turn green. See my thumb? It'll turn green. Uh, the mushroom itself, you can you can see, turns a shade of green. Um, it's a, the indicator that everything I read says. Of course, I'm not a mitologist, so I don't know exactly if that's what it is, but. If I had to bet money on it, that's what it would be. It's a blue milk cap mushroom. 
first time finding one. Anyway, I'll take these home and uh, get them ready for cooking. Put a few in the freezer. You ready, bud? Yeah.